ACCW's ACCW's Apple City champion, Coda Khan. Coda Khan. Coda. We're talking about Coda getting the job done. But now Coda, I'm the champ. Done. He's been lighting it up in ACCW. Also was lighting it up in USA main event. Lighting it up with like that pyro. Like that pyro. Coda Dunn has a list of accomplishments, folks, and has wrestled for a great many promotions as well. But his opponent. Daniel Alexander Bigelow, fun fact, in this building, the very first match, if I'm not mistaken, was these two kids. Guys. That's right, the very first match uh, of USA Main Events, Thursday Thunder, and were, were these two and meeting just, one-on-one. And just to see the ride that they've taken since that time. Both have grown tremendously. Both have honed their skills. Coda Dunn. Oh, Coda immediately. Coda Dunn under the tutelage of wrestling's best, Brett West. Brett West. Bell's rung. As Coda tried to ring a Bigelow's bell, throws him out, hits the table. Coda went a suicide dive on the outside, hits the barricade. Drayton follows it up. I'm sorry, Daniel, there's so many guys. Two. There's so many people here tonight. It's just hard to keep count of who's who. Daniel Alexander here. Daniel Alexander. Capitalizing. Bigelow hits a suplex. Go, Daniel. This is for my man, Jimmy. This is for Jimmy. I don't know who Jimmy oh, is, but, but I assume that's not what Jimmy wanted. But he had a big knee for his efforts. Followed by a big boot there to the side of the face. Right there on the chin. Coda Dunn with a big forearm there. Whips Bigelow into the corner. Now what's Coda going to plan on doing? Coda Dunn looking for that monkey flip, but, but Daniel Alexander scattered it. Of course, Bigelow. of course, Bigelow, Daniel Alexander Bigelow and Coda Dunn have uh, been on many of shows together, wrestled each other many a times, trained together at one point, I believe. Yes. So the animosity between both men is is there. They've feuded with each other on and off over these last few years. And both men know each other very well as well. And it looks like Bigelow was thrown off of the top rope. Coda's on the top. Oh! Coda done. That big double stomp. That could be it. Bigelow gets up at the count of two. And yes, the refs are cleaning the ring almost after almost every match. We're doing our best here, folks. As Coda Dunn fires some shots off, as Bigelow's on the ropes, looks like he's gonna whip a wicked forearm. Goes for Ben, two. Daniel Alexander gets up at the count of two. Just a two count there. So far, though, this the, Coda Dunn has been in full control of the matchup. Coda Dunn's been in control since the beginning here. Just using his boot to choke. Daniel Alexander Bigelow waits to the count of four, lets it go. Now, Coda, now I, don't, I don't like what Coda's doing here. I think Coda's got to stay on him. Got to stay in closer. Don't give uh, Daniel Alexander the room to breathe. But uh, Daniel Alexander gave the thumbs up to the ref right before that exchange, saying that he was good to go still. Big forearm there. Looks like he's trying to get in a... Trying to get that cross face in. Cross face in. Oh, but he... No. No, 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 no. There was a little bit of miscommunication there. Daniel Alexander Bigelow was saying no. 
The ref misheard him. We're going to restart the match. We're going to restart the match. <laughs> match is restarted as Dog. We're going to restart the match here. Daniel, Daniel Alexander Bigelow did not submit. Coda Dunn's continuing the fight. During the confusion, though, he's taking advantage of the situation right now. There's a little bit of miscommunication. And now Bigelow has control. Daniel Alexander looking for that big right hand. Coda Dunn catches him off guard there. And now both men are down on the ground. Uh, referee, look, it's hard being a referee. It's not as easy as anybody out there thinks it is. And that was a confusing call. Coda Dunn back to his feet there. But Bigelow definitely was saying no. But now Coda's just stepping on the back of the head and neck area of Daniel Alexander Bigelow. He just stomps on the back of his head. That's... It looks like... Trying to put the uh, put the hurting on Daniel Alexander. Trying to put him away here. And Coda now, Dunn. Coda Dunn's been in control here. He's got to finish him off. He's got to take advantage. He's taking advantage of the restart. Yeah. Bigelow with a couple of hands to the uh, midsection there. Jarred the chest of Coda Dunn on tr uh, Daniel Alexander Bigelow's knees. Absolutely both, would have taken, knocked the wind out of him. Both men down here. Both men paid the price on that maneuver, but it was a last-ditch effort from Bigelow. Both men now back to their feet at the count of seven. Axe handle from Bigelow on the Dunn. As he continues to put the uh, pressure on Dunn. Whips him into the ropes. Goes for a hip toss, but Dunn blocks it. Another hip toss has been blocked. Bigelow firing off a bunch of shots on the coat of Dunn. Big uppercut there. Big hip toss. Big hip toss. Now Bigelow's full of fire and lit up. A hip toss into a neck breaker there. Wow. Innovative offense there by Daniel Alexander Bigelow. And he's in full control of the match now. How the tides have turned, ladies and gentlemen. Come on! Come on! Wants him to... He, wa he, he wants... Crowd to, behind uh, Daniel Alexander Bigelow here. Done. Bigelow looks at that, that big hand there. Hits a go to sleep, follows a knee to the face, puts him in the cross face again. And now, the winner of this contest by submission and still Apple City champion, Kona Dunn. Held on to the submission as Kona, as a. Uh, and Bigelow is frustrated at the loss. And look, that confusion can happen to any of us. But, Cody, but that's why Cody does a champ. He saw the opportunity and the confusion, took advantage of it, used it, used the gap. Yeah, Cody Dunn picking up a yeah. big win here. Daniel Alexander, though, showing some heart. And Daniel Alexander didn't let the that get to him either. Fans are not liking Coda Dunn. Not. They don't. They don't care for the Apple City champion here. The Apple City champion, as he gets the job done tonight.